I don't know if I want to touch that thing. That thing looks scary. Also, yeah, I'm so freaking huge compared to everybody else. I don't know if I want to touch this. Um, okay. The device is strange. Made of taut flesh and pockmarked metal. It waits for something. The Zathisk. Vlacket's purity distilled. My duty. My right. You know what? Uh, let's investigate it first, because I don't trust this thing. The device is an ingenious synthesis of illithid anatomy and metal alloys. It hums with psionic energy, hinting at paths into unknown mines and unseen planes. Stand aside. My time has come. All right, you go ahead, Lazel. You be my guest. Praise Blacketh. Let it be done. Sit, child. Let the Zathisk end your suffering. I don't trust this. Something seems off. Something seems wrong here. Anybody else get a bad feeling? You must focus on the parasite at all times. The Zathisk will do the rest. Am I the only one scared? <laughs> oh! An unseen blade cleaves your mind in two. Impossible pain sears your bones and body in concert with Lazelle's. Um. Yes, child. Speak the Talakit. Meditate on its verses. You feel Lazel's mind rip and rupture. Is this purification? Is this the cure? I don't know. Uh. I don't know. This ain't looking good. Let Let's just wait and watch. Ooh. You share in Lazel's agony. Every cell within her skull bursts into a constellation of fragments, sorted and reassembled. Lazel will die if she remains. Oh shit, we gotta get her out of there. Uh no! My queen! Lazel? We're just gonna stand here and let it kill her. Is it is that the plan? Uh no, it's not the plan. <laughs> Since myriad spectres of Githyanki passed, this is their fate. This is their anguish. Lazel? Um. Uh. Uh, Lazel, we got. Uh, Lazel, we got. Oh no. Oh, okay. I thought I was not gonna pass that. Lazel, you need to get the fuck out of there. I feel it. Skin is stretching. Mind failing. Lazel? Oh, yeah, Lazel, get the fuck out of there. Oh, my God. Holy shit. What madness is this? The Zathis can nearly destroyed me. I am Githyanki. I will not be gay. My life's work. Gone. Uh-oh. And yet she lives. And so does her parasite. Well, her voice cuts with a fanatical edge, an obsession bordering on mania. If there's a chance the parasite lives, she wants it. Uh-oh. Um You're wrong. Can't you see it in her eyes? The parasite's dead. Let's just let's just try to charm her and everything will be fine. Really? Then all this destruction was a symptom of its power? <sighs> Incredible. I am disappointed that we could not extract it alive. It would have been an exceptional specimen. In any case, the problem is resolved. Leave me. I must salvage what I can. Holy shit! What the fuck? No! It can't be! It can't! This was my right! Are you okay? I followed pro 
protocol. I kept to my faith. Yet the Zathis might have killed me. Someone must have tampered with it. An aberrance I can't begin to comprehend. Um, are you dumb? Who could have tampered with the device? There must be a Sharlak in this crash. A traitor. The sort that is hunted, slaughtered, and erased from our history. Lazel, I think you're on some insane Few cope right now. Their queen. Fewer still would be so brazen. Now hurry. We must go to the Chirai and inform him of the Zathisk's tampering. Um, I don't think that was tampered. I think... I think that's how it was supposed to work. Keep a blade close. Oh, so hold on. You mind if I just, uh... Let's go. That is not what I meant to do. Be very, very quiet. Oh wait, here. Can I unlight Let's the candles? Here. Watch your back. Hold on. I want. I want to steal this specimen. Let's you were seen stealing. Uh oh. Resolving this peacefully. I just want. Get. Just give me the parasite. Come on. In getting caught. Just give me the parasite. Deny the accusation. The accusation falters. Nothing can be found to hold against you. I knew it! Ta-da! Can't give up now. There we go. Good job, Asterion. Ooh. Nice. Okay. Yeah, let's let's get out of here before this crazy lady does something else. Any more parasites? Another parasite! Tons of parasites. You should take a closer look. I'm just gonna grab this. What do we have here? And this. Here, don't mind me stealing all your parasites. I just need them to uh get stronger. There we go. Give me all those parasites. Also, I realized I should probably be sharing my parasites with my companions, but, um, too bad. Okay, she wanted to go somewhere else now. Take Lazel to the Inquisitor. Lazel, I don't... Lazel, I love you, but I don't think it was tampered with. Um, I think you're just dumb. She's like, no, it must have been tampered with. Who would even tamper with that? Why would anyone even tamper with that? I think you're being ridiculous. Oh, what's this place? Hatchery. I'd expect to see 15 eggs at the very least. Oh! There's only one egg over here. What the fuck? Where are all the other eggs? There's just one. Why is the hatchery so empty? Something's on the step carefully. There's a trap. Is Stick are permitted to view the birthing pools now? These are strange times. Step carefully while here. Our hatchery is protected by lethal safeguards. I do not wish to pick your remains from them. I thought a hatchery would have more eggs. Most are hatched. Only one remains. Monitored by Varsh Koku, the caretaker of our young. You may speak to the Varsh if you wish, but stay away from the egg. There will be no second warning. Oh. So could I try to buy... Th I really... Are you sitting in acid right... Oh my god, she's sitting in acid. <gasps> Thank you. Um, stay here. I want to see if I can actually go talk to that dude and maybe buy the egg. Be wary. This place is trapped. Lazel, I'm sorry, but I really, really want to see what happens. Be wary. This place is trapped. It's okay. Just jump over it. Watch how you go. There's a trap. So many traps. Hey, what's up? You mind if I have that egg? You can tell Kithrak Therizin that my position has not changed. The egg requires more time. Furthermore, 
Uh, Hello. I was not expecting an istic. What brings you to my hatchery? Um. Hold on, I'm gonna save. <laughs> I came here to steal an egg. I heard you were waiting for one last egg to hatch. Most caretakers would not give the child its fair chance. But I shall. There could be greatness in that shell. You note that the hope in his voice is tinged with weariness. It's the voice of a man who's fought the inevitable for a long time. It seems like an awful lot of fuss for one egg. What'll happen if the egg doesn't hatch? Kithrak Therizin will give orders to destroy it. She will say it's a weakling. I'll give it a while longer. And if it doesn't hatch, it will have proven her right. Ooh. Why risk its life at all? Give it to me, I'll take care of it. Ooh. You're out of time and clearly stalling. That's why she... Oh. I don't want to use intimidation. But yeah, give it to me. Give it to me. You? What do you know about Gith Yankee child rearing? Still, the captain's due for an inspection any day now. And if she sees it here... Tell me, what will you do with it if I entrust it to you? Ooh. Um. I'll make it the best omelet you've ever tasted! What the fuck is wrong with you guys? Oh my god. Uh... I don't know. I I could say an, I'll find another cliche one that's more forgiving, or I'll raise I'll I'll raise it as if it was my own flesh and blood. That's what I feared. Oh. Still, I'm sure its nature will pervade, even if raised among lesser species. I can no longer ignore that Kithrak Thurizen's patience has its limits. Very well. Here. Take these. They will aid your approach to the egg. Oh! What did he give me? Come out. Oh, boots! Ooh! Oh, I'm resistant to acid damage. Thank you! Oh, gods! It smells awful in here. <clears throat> Watch how you go. There's a trap. Holy shit. That's a lot of traps. Ooh. You know, I'm just gonna take the egg. I'm sure it's fine. Okay. Large green egg with an uneven shell. You can see a vague outline of something within it. It's beautiful. Crush the egg. I'm not crushing the egg. What is wrong with you, game? Oh, but I want to touch it. What happens if I touch it? The egg is warm to the touch. The rough shell like slate beneath your fingers. Whatever is within is stirring ever so slightly. Oh, it's cute. All right, let's pick it up and stow it in my pack. Let's get out of here. There's a trap. Ooh, thanks for the acid boots, though. Oh, Lazel's not happy with me taking the egg, huh? This is awkward. Lazel, Lazel, hey, hey, hey! An unhatched Githyanki egg should be the burden of a Vash, not a warrior, whether ascended or otherwise. And yet. I'm drawn to the warmth of it. A child of Gith and a servant of Vlakith grows within. Keep it close. Perhaps in our care, it might yet hatch. Wait! If I don't- Don't you dare pass it to that lunatic woman prowling the mountain pass. Wait, 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 guys, hold on. I was gonna give it to her? Because I was like, okay, if these guys don't want the egg, at least I'll give it to her so it can be taken care of. Are you telling me? Me and Lazel, hold on, I need to look this up. Can me and Lazel hatch this egg and become lesbian moms? Sorry, Asterian, I'm, you're need to put on hold. Um. 
Oh, wait, no. Okay, okay, okay. I need to give it to Lazel. I don't know if it'll hatch or not. But they obviously, I don't want to give it to the lady that um, Lazel told me to give it to. Right? I don't want to give it to her. So, I'm okay. Let me restart. Let me restart. Let's let's refresh our brains. I'm not gonna give the lay the egg to the lady who wants me to steal it. I'm gonna leave it with Lazel, and I'm gonna trust Lazel to take care of it. Cause at first I'm like, I was scared. I'm like, is this egg even gonna hatch? But I'm gonna leave it with Lazel, and hopefully it will hatch. I wouldn't- Aw, that'd be so cute if it hatches by the end of the game and Lazelle has, like, a little- a little son or daughter. That's actually so cute! Okay, yeah, before- before we go in here, I'm gonna take up a quick- Maybe Should I take a quick rest? So long as he leaves with what he came I'll take a quick rest. But yeah, that's so cute! I'm just gonna leave the egg with Lazel. Maybe it'll hatch throughout the game, like, when we get to Act 2 or 3. Maybe it'll hatch at the very end of the game. I don't know, but I'm gonna- I'm gonna keep the egg. I don't wanna give it to anybody. Ooh, who wants to talk down here? Carlac, what do you want? Hello, beautiful. Uh, hey, soldier, I- <sighs> Well, I'm not feeling so good. Carlac, are you okay? My engine. It's getting worse. <sighs> Feels like it's gonna burst out of my chest. Oh no. I need to find a mechanic. A good one. Well, this thing's going boom. Well, the next mechanic is at Moonrise. What'll happen? No. You're tough. That thing with the chest won't overpower you. Besides, didn't they say the mechanic is gonna be at Moonrise? Tell that to the inferno where my heart was, soldier. Actually, don't. I don't want to piss it off. Oh no! The 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 mechanic's supposed to be at Moonrise. What am I supposed to do? Hi, I haven't talked to you in a minute. You wish to speak? Uh, no, I don't. Oh fuck, Carlac! Please don't die! Please don't die! Please don't die! I'm gonna be so upset! Please don't die! It's fine. We'll just go to sleep for the night and everything will be fine. Carlac will be fine. Hey, the owl bear! I forgot about you! What's up? Blood hurts. Oh no! Are you okay? Get out of here! What are you- Attack and get out of here? What the fuck is wrong with this? What the fuck is wrong with you people? Look. Cut. Oh, are you okay? Hold still, I'll make it better. As the wound closes, the cub begins testing his weight on the leg. Good. No hurt. Aw, how did this happen? Teeth. Claws. Bigger. You fought something bigger than you? Why would you do that? Strong. Fight. Win. <laughs> and did you kill it? Kill? No. Strong. Show you. Oh. <laughs> Adorable. Let me know when it brings you something fresh. Yeah, the owl bear is like a cat that's gonna bring me dead squirrels, and Asterion's gonna eat them. Oh, that was so cute. Okay, now we can finally call it a night. That's so cute. I love the owl bear cub. That's so adorable. <sighs> so is the owl bear? The owl bear's just at my camp now. Oh my god, let's go! Wait, wait, wait. Where's my animal speech? That's so cute. You're just at my camp now. Hello. You are not food. You are friend. Friend, not food. Oh, oh, this is so cute. More. more? Okay, listen, you got it, buddy. You want more head scratches? I'll give you more. I love this. More. 
This is so cute. You like it here, huh? Nice here. The caves smell like rotting meat. Goblin cat smells like goblins. Looks like I'm stuck with you. Yes. Fun. Oh. I love the albert. They're so cute. They're my favorite. Oh my goodness. Hey Scratch, what's up? Hope you're keeping well, friend. How are you doing, Scratch? You want to scratch? Scratch want to scratch? I love this. I'm just... Okay, I thought in this game, you would only have like four or five companions. But they keep just giving me more and more. And I am not complaining. I also love the pets too. I love Scratch. I love the owl bear. It's so pleasant to have them. I love it. It's so cute. Alright, let's go talk to... Whoever Lazelle wanted me to talk to. What's going on here? I can explain. The latest batch of cultists knew nothing of the astral prism. They were just trying to find Moonrise. They all head there. My Gish have drafted plans to assault the tower. They are ready to fight. Chitrai, we could sift the missing artifact from the tower's ashes if you would give us. Quiet. Find the astral prism, Therizin. My patience falters. Wow. Yes, Chirai. You heard him. Go! Do as she says. She remains your Kithrak. For now. I feel as though there's some sexual tension here. Or maybe just tension. I don't know. I'm bad at reading rooms. Shut those doors. Oh. Uh, hello. Um, you mind if I have that thing back? I kind of need that. <gasps> Ooh, what are you? Won't say a dwarf, armor and all. Took me a whole ten day to pass him. Oh, thanks. I did not need to know that. Oh, those are the cultists, huh? If she keeps making me eat armor, I'm going on hunger strike. Uh-huh. Mind if I have that key you just took? An istic in my crash. You are one of the mercenaries sent to bring the weapon. The istic is with me, honored Kithrak. So noted. But my question goes unanswered. Do you bring the weapon? Um... Don't tell her anything. Ooh! I, I sure I have a weapon. Want to see your blood on it? Um, I seek audience with your inquisitor. There's a traitor among you. She speaks the truth, Kithrak. A Sharlak. Among us? Whom would you accuse? Ooh! Kithrak Voss, your doctor. Ooh! It's only for the Inquisitor to know. Take me to him. Vague allegations and undue demands. A poor introduction for an unproven istic. The very same said to hold the weapon we seek. Shemar's Allah Give it to me. I will not. No. Then I will take it from your corpse. Well, this is awkward. Listen, man, I just... I just... Come on, I just wanted the key. Just give me the key to the door. That's all I wanted. Oh. She made him drop her weapons. Oh, no. That's not good. Well. Where's, where's your weapon? I don't want to accidentally destroy it. This is fine. Don't you dare call the guards, you little bitch. Ow. Will you guys stop running? Oh, and now they have to go all the way back there to pick up their weapons. God damn it. 
Well, this is not good. This is fine. This is fine. Ooh, very nice. Uh-oh. Damn, the whole crochet is pissed at us. Oopsie. I'm sure this is fine. I'm sure this is fine. I'm sure this is fine. I'm gonna do that to you. Flash you. Only one damage? That's crazy. Stan, will you stop running around like an idiot? Critical miss, are you serious right now? Okay, there you go. Yeah, just go, go kill your companion. I'm kind of busy right now. Let's get me fire, baby. All right. Want another? Miss! You have like an 80% chance. Why are you missing? Oh yeah, the whole cliche is pissed at us now. Well, that's not good. Well, swift as my feet can carry me. This is awkward. Woo, very nice. Okay, Asterion, baby girl, go pick up your weapon. Over here. Nice. Yeah, you two just go kill each other. Okay, Lizelle, go pick up your weapon, please. God, I hate that they dropped their weapons. Okay. Um. In my best interest. Damn. Nice. All right, you get your booty over here. Oh my god, stop making me drop my weapon! Fuck's sake! Not that! Right, give me my weapon back. My goodness gracious. Where did my weapon go? I wasn't using a regular ass bow, was I? Was I? It's mine now. Was I? Was I seriously? I don't know. I don't know. I give up. I mean, I guess they are kind of using basic ass weapons. How have I not gotten better weapons for you guys? Why do you guys have such bad weapons? I just realized. No time to rest. Well, hopefully the corpses will have better weapons for you. <gasps> they do. Don't mind if I do. Ooh! <gasps> when wielded by a Gith Yankee, deals more psychic damage. Lizelle, why don't you have that just for you? Phew! <laughs> Bless me. Well, I really was not hoping to fight them. I just, I just wanted the key to the door, man. That's all I wanted was the key to the door. Why'd you have to make me do that? Whatever, shot. whatever, whatever. Who would be? Oh, it is you. I make haste. We have business to conduct. Okay, let's.
let's go! I should probably do a, a short rest too. All right, everybody, where are we going? Also, Lazelle is tweaking. She, that doctor lady tried to kill her and she's like, no, there's an imposter. Somebody sabotaged. I don't think there's a traitor. I think Lazelle is just on hard copium right now. It's never been that simple before. I don't know why it would be now. You know, maybe Lazelle is finally learning that her people aren't that fucking good. Yeah, I'll just leave her with the egg and hopefully it'll hatch like in act two or three or maybe it'll hatch at the end of the game. I don't know, but I, I, I hope it does hatch and it just doesn't just sit in our inventory forever. I really hope it hatches. Hello! Ah, our esteemed guest. My Arden spoke of one of our kin that escaped a crashing geek slave vessel. Chirai, Vlakith's justice in flesh. You have accomplished much, child. I am pleased to finally meet you. I heard there is so much goblin blood on your hands that it soaks their children's nightmares. To business. I suspect you plucked something precious from the Geek ship. Something that belongs to us. Ooh. The weapon. Give it to me. No! Don't do it. The weapon is how I protect you. Yeah, Do if... It. Do not disobey the Inquisitor. Yeah, but if we... If we give you the weapon, isn't that, like, the only thing stopping us from turning into Mind Flayers? How do you know so much about me? Some of your species say knowledge is power. They are wrong. Knowledge is everything. We took an interest in you when you became involved with this absolute cult. A pestilence of infected slaves. The first symptom of the grand design in action. But you are lucky. That weapon you carry is the solution. I have heard it from Queen Vlakith herself. Hand it over. What is the grand design? The grand design is what all geek seek. The restoration of the Illithid Empire, which spanned the entirety of the multiverse. For centuries there, elder brains sought to bring back their dominion. Every plot they hatched, we stopped. But now they are close to succeeding. Never before could they pause Ceremorphosis. Never before could they let the infections spread undetected. You saw the thralls gathered on the Geek ship. Imagine that everywhere. Wants, needs, choice, all would cease to be. Everything rendered unto the Geek. So, the weapon. Please. Please. Well, guess Don't what? Give it to him. No. I'm sorry, but I can't let you take it. Do not try me. Hand over the artifact or die by my hand. Lazel! After everything we've been through, you would kill me. Remember the Zaythisk? These gifts can't be trusted. Follow my lead. I'll choose the right path. The Zaythisk. It's, it's cruel. I hate that you speak the truth. Choose. Your path is mine to follow. <gasps> okay, so she will follow me. Yeah, I'm sorry, but your your people are kind of really shitty. Sorry, we're keeping the artifact. Our fate is forged. Mother Gith, guide us. Your illustrious adventure ends here. Hetasif! Sorry, sorry, I gotta keep this thing. This thing is literally the only thing protecting me from becoming a mind flayer. I literally cannot lose this. I, I literally cannot lose this. Hi, you mind if I get up close and personal with you? Oh, owie. Owie. Get your booty back here. I'm not done with you. I am gonna move back though. <laughs> All right. Um. I'm gonna make you 
will go mad. And then I'm gonna give you this. Okay, I'm like, please don't, please don't disarm me again, because that sucks so much. All right, I'm gonna smack the shit out of you. And then I'm gonna smack the shit out of you. And then, wait for it, wait for it. I'm gonna smack the shit out of you. And then wait, 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 wait for it. Now, I'm gonna smack the shit out of you again. And then, I'm gonna smack the shit out of you. Ooh, what's this? Ooh, I'm gonna smack the shit out of you again! Don't mind if I do. Oh, mind steal link? What does that do? Oh, that's not good. Well, that's okay, because I'm gonna smack the shit out of you. I'm gonna smack the shit out of you. No! You missed! Smack the shit out of him right now! There you go. Good job. Good job, Carla. Anyways, um, you are going to die. I'm gonna back up just a little bit. No choice but to keep going. You are also going to die. Actually, I don't think I can kill you. Damn. That's really sad. I need to get a better bow for myself. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna stab you a little bit. Get back here! I need to kill you! Why do I have three misty steps? All right, hit her! There you go, hit her again! There you go. Impressive resistance, but futile. But futile, he says, as he's the only one left alive. And now he's dead. These things have stayed interesting. Inquisitor Wargas was potent. We are impressed. Hello? Oh, flashbang. Oh. My queen. Skarsai. You are permitted to look upon me. You are invited to me. The Deathless Queen has spoken. You will obey. <laughs> Wave politely. Hello! What's up? Hi! I'm Mushroom. I expected little of Istic education. But here, we kneel before our Queen. Well... Your choice of allies is most vexing. They do not become you, Lazel. Chma Zala Vlaketh. You know me. Erlon of Kalia speaks most highly, as did Archaia before. You seek purity. I may yet grant it. You bear that which is ours. But are you friend or are you thief? Well, I'm not a thief. Neither. It's mine by right. No, it is not yours. To own something is to note that weapon you carry. The astral prison. It is corrupted. I will cleanse it for you, my queen. Tell me how. There is someone inside. Their mind is warped. Broken. A blight! They are an agent of the grand design. Sent to sabotage the astral prison. Our last defense against the return of the Elithid Empire! Whoa! As they live, the prison 
is compromised. Kill them! Do this, and I will cleanse you and your allies. Do this, and ascend! Lazel, I love you, but every Gith Yankee we've met so far have been bad. Like, they to pure to purify you, she wanted to kill you, destroy your brain, and rip out the parasite. Your queen, I'm sorry, is just sucking up to you so she can get that prism. That prism is the only thing keeping us alive, Lazel. I can't do that. <laughs> can't you kill them yourself? I thought gods were all powerful. Perhaps I miss her. You would not speak ill of a god, would you? And what if I was? She will be our ruin. All right, all right. I spoke too hastily. Please forgive me. Obey, my child, and be forgiven. Use the planecaster's power to enter the artifact. Be wary of the creature's lying tongue. Cut it out if you must. You will not leave this room until it is done. Barn is in. I'll each step with purpose. Ooh, flashbang! Vlaketh has spoken. Do not leave this room except to enter the prism. Turn your back on me, and you will feel my blade against it. Lazelle, I love you, but like, you are so stupid. Like, when do you not realize, like, you're being lied to? Your queen is lying to your face. She's not gonna ascend you. She's not gonna purify you. The second we kill that person, we're gonna turn into mind flayers, and she's gonna kill us. But I'm gonna wrap it up there. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'm sorry, I'm going to leave it on this little, you know, bit of a cliffhanger. And next, in the next episode, we'll, we, we will quote unquote purify the thing. I'm probably going to go inside and speak to my guardian. I doubt I'm going to kill them because no way I'm killing them. They are literally the only reason I'm alive right now. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, make sure to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys tomorrow. So good night. Goodbye. Mwah.